choice, Moshe was put in a basket in the River Nile. Basia saw Moshe in the basket and she stretched out her arm to get Moshe Rabbeinu. Rashi explains to us that a nest happened. Her, her arm extended really far and that's how she was able to get Moshe Rabbeinu. The question is, why was it necessary for Hashem to make such a huge nest to get Moshe Rabbeinu? Couldn't the wind just blow him to the side? Could it be he was at the side? Why did Hashem need to make this miracle that Bas's arm extended all the way to Moshe Rabbeinu? The answer for this is beautiful. There are many children which desperately need to be saved. And people might say, this child is far too lost. He's far too far gone and we can't save him. I don't believe I'll be successful if I try and help this child. And they won't try. And this is a big mistake. This is a lesson we learned from Basia. Did she know if she can save Moshe Rabbeinu or not? She didn't know. But what she did, she tried. And Hashem showed us that if you try and you do your bit, Hashem will do the rest. So, in every single aspect of our life, whether it's saving a child, whether it's our, in our own life, our own growth, even if we think we can't succeed, we won't be successful, we still have to put in the effort and try, and Hashem will do the rest. And this is the lesson and the reason why Hashem made a miracle with Basia. I think Dubai epitomizes this idea of not making too many calculations whether they would become a huge built-up popular tourist destination. They had so many things working against them. It's so difficult to build on a desert. It's very difficult to get water in a place where it never rains. But they didn't make too many calculations. They wanted to do something, so they just started. And look what happened. They were extremely successful and they built one of the biggest and the best cities. So what we can learn from this week's Hedra is, never be hopeless. Even if something seems impossible, give it a go. Try it. Because if we do our part, Hashem will help us out with the rest. You should all have an amazing Shabbos.